Fence attorney in Taylorsville is defending himself tonight against charges he made sexual advances toward female clients. News Channel 36's Alex Reed took our mobile newsroom to that town northwest of Statesville in Iredell County. He's live at 6 with what one victim and one investigator are saying about this. Alex? Well, Dave, people usually come to this attorney for help, but tonight he may need some help of his own. So far, well-known defense attorney Ed Jenkins is charged with one count of sexual battery, but police say several more charges are pending, and, you know, at least three of his former clients have come forward so far with similar charges, and one of those victims spoke with us today. A client for many years was shocked by what her attorney did to her in his office. I kept it together until I walked outside the door, and that's when I started crying. She asked that we conceal her identity, but told us. He put his arms around me like in a, in a bear hug, and I kind of pushed back. And when he come at me trying to kiss me, that's when I pulled back. I said no, and he said, well, I need things too, and I said no. After receiving three separate complaints from three clients about attorney Ed Jennings, Taylorsville police sent an undercover officer inside his office. The decoy was a female police officer, and she was assaulted also in a sexual manner. The arrest warrant shows he groped the officer's chest within minutes of her arrival. A short time, less than 30 minutes. Jennings is charged with sexual battery, a misdemeanor. One victim was unsure about coming forward, but is now glad she did. Because I didn't, it's hard telling how many other people he's done it to, and I wasn't going to let him do me like that. The 60-year-old is released on an unsecured bond tonight, but police say there are several more charges which are pending against him. If you may have been a victim or if you have any information, you are asked to call the Taylorsville Police Department. Reporting live from our mobile newsroom in Taylorsville, Alex Reed, News Channel 36.